seven. Brought to you by absolutely no one. You caught a. Hey, I was going to bring up what happened in Boston earlier today when Danny Ainge decided to, to call it quits. Yeah. To elevate the Brad Stevens to their um their uh the the, the basketball czar position. Yeah. So who else is going to coach? But the biggest bombshell came in the basketball world. Coach K, Coach Mastrzewski, is going to call a career after next season. Yeah. So basically, in two years, you're going to have in the ACC and in college basketball, you're going to have mm-hmm. no Roy Williams, mm-hmm. and you're not going to have Coach Mike Krzyzewski. Yeah. I we all knew it's going to be that's going to what's going to happen inevitably. Yeah. But damn, this is, seems kind of quick, right? Not really. And the reason why I say that, I think this past season was was telling. Mm. The way it went down for him, I, I mean, I, I I was thinking at the time it was kind of an anomaly, but it, it just seemed weird. He just seemed like he was just didn't want to be here mm-hmm. um, last season. So when the, when the announcement was, was made, I'm like, okay, I'm not too shocked. Mm-hmm. I'm not because yeah, it, it just it, it, he didn't seem like, and, and it was also the, the play of his team. And the fact that his team wasn't playing well, um, and they they you know young teams just not having the opportunity and the time to gel with one another and play better. Now they'll probably end up playing a whole lot better next season. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I, 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 it, it seems quick. But yeah, last year was very telling to me, at least. Yeah, exactly. So, and plus, Roy Williams, God bless him. Yeah, he kind of saw the right on the wall. He was getting physically tired. You could see that. Mm-hmm. And you know, his team made the tournament last year. COVID really did a number on his program as well. Yeah. So it's it's it was time. Then I expect that Coach Beheim is going to call it quit soon. Oh, soon, yeah. And um, so basically, in the in the and probably Leonard Hamilton because Leonard Hamilton is damn near eighty. So see, that's the thing because and he looks he great. Does, he does look great. Yeah. I want these guys to get out of basketball and live a life, man. Enjoy yeah. your family. Do something, yeah. man. You know, mm-hmm. you, you've you done what you can. You know, and I'm saying you've done what you can for the sake of uh, Leonard Hamilton, who unfortunately hasn't won a national championship, but mm-hmm. has had great teams. Right. So, yeah, go ahead, man. Get out of this rat race of basketball. Live your life and enjoy your family. Yeah. Yeah. And so, so basically, all you're going to have left are the Bennett guy, Mm-hmm. Get his first name out of Virginia. Tony. Tony, Tony. Bennett from Virginia. Mm-hmm. Now I got Hubert Davis and his white wife at UNC. I don't say that as a racist thing. I said because he said a stupid he ass did, comment. He really did that say we it. did yeah. not want to know that he had a wife. That was totally unnecessary. I can't believe he said it. Anyway, you're going to have him. You're going to have John Shire, who's going to be now a coach of Wayne at Duke. Mm-hmm. You kind of like that move, but that's another story for another time. And of course, brother man Kevin Keith at uh, NC State. Mm-hmm. That's pretty much it as far as the bigger names. Yeah. In the conference at the bigger schools. Oh, of course, and uh, Jeff Capel is still at Pitt. He's doing a damn thing at Pitt. He's yeah. improving that situation. So that's it. That's your young blood. Changing of the guard, man. Yeah. It was bound to happen. Forward. Yeah. It is what it is. So we'll see what happens at. I think Carolina's going to do all right because they kept Hubert Davis. He's one of the big recruiters. Mm-hmm. Same with Josh Shire. He's been there for a while. He played for mm-hmm. Coach K. He knows culture. He knows the deal. Um, so that's good that they have all that set up in place for those two men. I almost said young men, but Hubert's older than we are. And Shire, he's in his 30s, late 30s. Yeah. So, but anyway. Yeah, yeah, Hubert is a, a couple of more years older than we are. Yeah, yeah he's older than we are. Um, yeah. Not by a lot, but... Yeah, so so it's 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 go 